Hey guys, my name is Hugo Bantin Jr. and today we're gonna be listening to Void by Melanie Martinez. She decided to randomly drop this single today and I'm very excited. Obviously this is the next track after death and I was also wondering if it does lead into Void. Obviously it cuts off in death, like at the end of death. So I'm guessing it's gonna lead into Void audibly. So that's exciting. And also don't mind me looking like a mess. I've been editing all day. I've been really busy on my PC. So let's just get started on this. <laughs> oh my god. This is gonna slap so hard. Oh my god. Her vocals are so raw. Oh my god. Yeah, her vocals are so raw in this. I love it. I also love that a lot of the songs seem to be rock in this album, which is great. I love this. I love it so much. Obviously, this is from the snippet, so. The void ain't made. Little mess I've done. There's no way to ride, yeah. The void, like a breeze behind confession. Walls of judge myself. Kneeling on a metal crater. I won't live to see the day tomorrow Someone tell me if this is hell I gotta skip that void There is no other choice yet Trying to turn down the voices The void ain't made Look at the mess I've done Oh no, it's gone The void I judge myself Kneeling on Such a fucking bop, what? I'm gonna be streaming the shit out of this. What the fuck? There's no way to run. Oh my god. <gasps> wow. Holy shit. Oh my god, that was such a bop, dude. I'm gonna be blasting that on my speakers. You know what's crazy? That's not even the highest volume on my speakers. I had to turn it down, obviously, because it, it'll be too loud. But, wow. Void sounds so good. I'm just excited for all the songs. Battle of the Larynx? I know that bitch is gonna hit, because I fucking love Battle of the Larynx. Tell you what. Because, oh my god, the chorus of it, so good. It's so good. Like, the drop in the actual snippet is amazing. I'm excited for Battle of Bitch, not me stuttering. I'm excited for Battle of the Larynx as well. And also Evil. Evil seems like it's gonna be that bitch too. I really do appreciate that this song talks about mental health and trying to escape your own self-doubt and bad talk in your brain. It literally goes from being very negative and talking about all the things that you don't like about yourself, all the things that you think are wrong with yourself, and then turning it into this blossoming, beautiful bouquet of flowers where it's very hopeful and energetic to just get the fuck out of that mindset and escape the void basically that's what the metaphor is about piano oh, wow this is so cool i'm so excited for the rest of the tracks oh my gosh 
I can't believe she decided to like randomly drop this new single on us right before the actual album comes out. It's coming out in two days. So I wonder if Void is gonna have a music video. Cause I know technically if you go into a portal, you're gonna be in a tunnel. So I'm wondering if the movie is gonna start off with tunnel vision and not death and void and death and void is just gonna have their own music videos that's some speculation i'm wondering if that's gonna be the case but i do need to listen to the other snippets too i heard there's other snippets for nymphology and womb and stuff so hope you guys enjoyed tell me what you think in the comments what you think is gonna happen next sonically like audio wise Tell me what you think about this song. Do you like it or dislike it? Is it a bop to you? Is it going to be played on repeat? I know it's going to be played for me. <laughs> so hope you guys enjoyed. Like, subscribe, and comment for more videos like these. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Y'all, I just fucking realized that the album cover is literally animated as well. Look, uh, it's fucking blooming and shriveling up. What did I tell y'all? It was literally blossoming. A bouquet.